mRNA is a new revolutionary drug modality. Synthetic mRNA encoding therapeutic proteins is incorporated into nanoscale carrier and administered to target cells. In the cells, the mRNA is released into the cytoplasm, followed by protein translation using the similar machinery for the regular processes of gene expression. For the mRNA delivery, we used our original synthesized polymer-based nanocarrier. This system is based on block copolymer composed of hydrophilic segment of polyethylene glycol and hydrophobic segment of polyamine acid. We designed the polymer structure to provide specific biofunctions such as cell targeting, drug loading, and release. By mixing the block copolymers with mRNA, a micellar structure is spontaneously formed. This structure is called polyplex nanomicelles. The mRNA is loaded in the core of the nanomicelles surrounded by peg surface. The size of nanomicelles is regulated to be several 10 nanometers, providing excellent tissue permeability. We applied the mRNA loaded nanomicelles for the treatment of several ischemic diseases which would cause various neurologic disorders. We used a rat model of transient global ischemia called TGI, in which neuronal death is induced specifically in the vulnerable hippocampus with gradually progressive manner for several days. Then we injected mRNA encoding brain-derived neurotrophic factor BDNF into the brain. These are the histology sections of the hippocampus after the administration of BDNF mRNA. Very interestingly, the mRNA administration on day two provided the maximal effect of neuroprotection even compared with the administration just after the TGI. This graph showed the cell counts of living or dead neurons. When the mRNA was injected on day two, we obtained the largest number of living neurons. The therapeutic effect was confirmed by a behavioral test to analyze the memory function. After 20 days of TGI, the treated rats with BDNF mRNA showed an improved memory function. Finally, we investigated the target cells of mRNA. mRNA was mostly introduced into astrocytes. In contrast, there are much less signals in neurons. Considering the mechanism of action of BDNF, we think that augmented BDNF secretion from the astrocytes provided a more supportive microenvironment for the damaged neurons to tolerate ischemic stresses. An important message is that we can expect unique mechanism of action by the mRNA therapeutics which can open a new therapeutic strategy.